What's up, everybody? It's a YouTube troll here, and um, wanted to make a discussion about four bursts. So here it is. I tried yesterday, didn't go so well. Now I'm trying today. Let me just specify that I think four bursts will be a worth DLC. It's gonna be a potential DLC that's gonna be worth the money that's gonna be put into it. Fifteen dollars, guys, do not make a hole in your pocket. So stop acting like it fucking does, okay? Just simply gonna say that out loud. If you guys don't wanna get it, then don't purchase it. It's just really that simple. You always have a choice to buy something. They they're not forcing it on you. It's not like you can never play Storm 3 again without the DLC. So why is it such a big deal for you guys that they're releasing full burst? Why? I, I want to get the DLC, so I'm going to get it. It's just that simple. I, I don't see why you guys are making it seem like a life or death situation. Um, I understand you guys are mad that the Erokage is in there. I understand you guys are mad the Swordsman ain't there. But you guys have to think about it like this, right? I came up with an idea, right, while I was playing Storm 3. I was like, well, they never released DLC for any Storm game. But they're doing it now with Storm 3. Could this mean that perhaps after full burst they might actually come out with other characters that this is what i'm thinking now a lot of people are gonna be like well if they do i'm not paying for that shit they should be in the game already listen if they do add them as dlc and they charge you for it you have the option to buy it or not buy it or you know here's a better option ask a friend that bought it to give you his account so you can use license transfer to download it for yourself and it'll be free for you and then your friend will still have it if you guys don't know what license transfer on Xbox is look it up you guys will see what it is um but anyways i feel that full burst should get judged upon when it's out not before because the thing is we haven't seen enough of it to make um such a hasty opinion about it like that so many people are like, oh, this is shit because it's only one character, uh, there's only one boss battle. I don't like the fact that there's only one of everything. I don't like that shit. But you know what? I feel that they're at least trying to come out with DLC, so I'm going to support it because they haven't done that in the past. $15 isn't going to burn a hole in my pocket, so whatever. It's no big deal. It's $15. Uh, if you guys don't want to spend that, fine. That's it. What I like to do is... Or before I buy a game, I go online, search on Amazon for the reviews. If it's good, I'll, I'll pretty much have a positive outlook of the game before I buy it. And then I'll go on YouTube and look at gameplay. If I like the gameplay, the mechanics, the game, the, the way the game works, I'll buy it, right? I, I don't make blind purchases, so you shouldn't either, right? Because obviously your money is... You, you earn your money, so obviously it's gonna fucking hurt if you spend money on something that you don't want. All I'm saying is, if you guys are doubtful about full burst, wait for gameplay to come out. Wait for people to review it. Wait for people to do a walkthrough on it. Whatever. That's how I do things. Because it's better to see gameplay and be, you know, I, I, don't, know, I don't know how to say it, but... It's better to just pretty much be well educated about what you're gonna buy before you buy it, I guess. It's the best way to put it. Because I don't wanna fucking buy full burst not knowing shit about it. What the fuck? I don't do that shit, man. I have to actually see how it looks, how it's gonna play out, and whether I think it's good or bad. If I think it's good, buy it. If I think it's bad, skip on it. No big deal. Move on, right? Now, if you guys think that full burst might mean that some other DLC is gonna come out in the future, Leave it down in the comments as well. And don't forget, tell me if you think Full Bird is going to be good or bad in the comments. And tell me why, alright? This has been YouTube Troll, motherfucker. And I'm out. Peace.